and today I'm going to be showing you how to make this adorable um, little igloo buff um, bookmark. Um, so yeah, let's just get right to it. Okay, so the materials that you're going to need are um, a pink piece of paper, but that's optional if you want to make igloo buff um, like I am, then um, you can use whatever color paper you want. Wait, no. If you're making um, an igloo buff like I am, uh, then you can use pink, but you don't have to make igloo buff. You can make whatever Pokemon you want. Or anything, really. So first, you um, fold this piece of paper down like this. And make sure it's pretty yeah. even. And then make a crease up here. So this is basically how you make the basic um, bookmark. So fold it like this. And basically it looks like the Star of a Fortune Teller. Um, so then you take this and you cut off the extra. Then you put that aside. Then you have your basic um, triangle. Then you take the triangle and you take the two ends and you fold them up here um, to make kind of like a diamond shape. You take the other corner and you do the same. If you already know how to make one of these bookmarks, then you can skip this part and just learn how to make a glue box. Okay, so here I have uh, basically my diamond shape. So then you unfold the triangles and you take one of the flaps of this at the top and you fold it down uh, to get to um, come down here. And you crease that. Then you fold these up one more time just to make sure it's nice and secure. But yes, this looks good um, according to my perspective. And then um, you, un you unfold it again. And you take this and you open up uh, the little thing right here. And you fold um, the, the triangles into um, the flap that we just did, and then that's basically just how you make uh, the bookmark. And now we're going to turn this bookmark into an igloo box. So for this, um, I'm going to be using um, colored Sharpies. You can use whatever kind of marker you want. Okay, so you need red and black. So you take the red first, and you make basically two red circles. This is simple. And then you take the black, and you color um, a bit of a smaller circle inside of the red. Then you color in the black. Which, that's very easy. And you color basically inside of the red circle. So this is a very simple and fun to do project that you can just do at home if you're bored and you don't want to spend that much time on technology. Um, then you can just do one of these projects. Um, so then just finish making the eyes. And there you have your basic igly buff eyes. Uh, now what I'm gonna do here is um, I'm gonna take um, a separate white sheet of paper like this and I'm gonna cut out two small little white circles just to put inside the eyes to make Igly Buff a bit more kawaii looking because if you don't know me that well I love kawaii stuff I think it's absolutely adorable um, so I, I, if you make the circle too big that's fine you can just trim it down a little bit which that's what I'm going to do because my circle is huge okay so then you bring it here, and then you can either tape or glue it on. Uh, that is up to you. Um, but you can really do whatever you want. I'm going to be using um, clear scotch tape, and I'm just going to be basically taping down on the eyes. And once I'm done with doing Igly Buff, then um, I'm going to show you some of the other um, bookmarks that I made previously. And yeah. So here I have my second circle. 
So you can use the strategy if you want to, um, but you don't have to. You could use glue. Um, so you're gonna get out your tape if you're using this method. Okay. Um, and you just basically put the scotch tape down on the eye. This will protect the eye from harm. It will also keep the white thing um, down on the eye. Um, because if it wasn't secure, that would kind of suck. Uh, so there, basically, you have your Igly Buff eyes. Now, this is probably the most important part for me. Um, so I'm going to put, like, if you don't know how to make a kawaii face, basically you just make adorable little eyes, kind of like this, and then you draw, like, basically a lowercase w for the mouth. And one other detail that is on Igly Buff is the little swirl that's on the top, which I am going to be doing that. Uh, just because I want this to be as Igly Buff-like as possible. So there, basically, yeah, that's it. You have your Igly Buff um, bookmark. And I think this turned out very cute and very fun to do. So yeah, thank, thank you guys for watching. And here's some of my other bookmarks. Um, I made a Togepi. Togepi is one of my favorites. I made a Mimikyu. I made a Bulbasaur, uh, I made an Espeon, I, sorry, that's my brother's, um, I made a Pikachu, and I made an Eevee, so, yeah, so, just follow the simple steps, and you can make whatever Pokemon you want, or basically whatever you want, I just chose to make a rebuff, so, yeah, thanks for watching, bye guys!